Hello, happy Friday. How y'all doing? Y'all know it's the last Friday in the month, so I'm having a 20% off sale. The code is Splash20, so you get 20% off everything, even stuff that's already on sale. Hey, Classy. How y'all doing today? And y'all know we're going to be on Twitch later. I should have brought my new jars up here. So if y'all follow me on Instagram, if y'all look at my last video that I did, I showed off like the new containers I got. What's y'all opinions on them if y'all saw that? You trying to be happy on your birthday for once. So we'll see about so we'll see about today. If today's your birthday, happy birthday, classy. We'll be watching or playing on Twitch tonight. Um, that I don't know yet, but uh, probably Roblox and Dead by Daylight for sure. I just don't know what else. Classy, why I hold myself on the fishing game? Because I was playing on the browser at first with y'all, right? And then why the browser history started over. So I can't get in my main account to like do the clan stuff. So anybody that wanted to join after the fact that ain't in the clan because I made it private, I wouldn't even be able to add them because I don't know how to get back into that account. Sad. Sad days. Yeah, that's why the last time I streamed it, I had to make another account because it started over. So I can't get in the, in the clan thing. Maya, thank you for... Wait, Maya just became a sponsor? Wait. Huh? What what does that mean? <laughs> Wait a minute. Let me pull up my stream elements because what is a sponsor? Huh? Happy birthday. Let me play you and hope I'll get this. That's for you, Classy. Happy birthday. What is going on? Stream Element says Maya just became a sponsor. What the hell is that? I'm over here like, Maya, are you here? What does that mean? See, this is what happened when you got bots all over the place. <laughs> Let me see something. I got two new followers on Twitch.
I don't like that. Like this game ain't counting everybody either that that did this stuff. I don't know what a member, what a sponsor is though. Hey, sweet lady. Stream Elements is the bot. I know who Maya is because I've seen their name before, but I don't know what they did to like trigger that. Because I'm looking at my alerts. It literally. Yeah, I don't know. But thank you, Maya. I don't know if, if Maya became like a member or like subbed or did something like that. I, I don't know. I know I need my fishing sponsorship to do right though because they not adding this stuff up right. Cause if I look in the clan thing, I know at least 20 of y'all did the first level cause that's the easiest thing to do. And then I know at least seven or eight people did the Mediterranean fishery. So I'm gonna have to message them about it cause they tripping with this. But yes, if y'all would like to order from my store today, don't forget to use the code FLASH20 for 20% off. Y'all know it's the last Friday in the month, so I'm trying to get rid of some products. Next week, I will have another drop of newer stuff. I will add six more anime scents, because those were ones I meant to do at first and didn't get a chance to do them. So I have six new anime scents. It'll, it'll be two more for My Hero, two more for Demon Slayer, and two more for Jujutsu Kaisen. And um, I'll have some more lotions. I probably, I think I got a lot of body mist left. I don't know if I'm making any more body mist, but more scrubs. Oh yeah, I'll have uh, the little two ounce lotions next week, like the, the, the travel size ones. I'll have those regular size lotions and scrubs for sure next week. So I'll have more coffee scrubs. I think I still got brightness scrubs, but then I'll have more uh, scents. I got three new scents coming too, but I don't know if they're gonna come in time, so we'll see. Cause this company, depending on what company I order from, some people are quick, some people aren't. Yeah, I saw. It probably was media stuff though. That's the thing about making your relationship public. People on social media have you feel like you got problems when you ain't got none just because they miserable. So she should have probably kept that to herself. Like her getting out of jail, like that was public enough. The stuff that they were doing and uh, her putting her husband out there like that, she probably should have just kept it to herself. Uh, my birthday is in April, but it's at the end of the month. So if y'all don't follow me on Twitch, please do, because I am going to do um, a subathon birthday stream. So depending on how many subs or tips I get for my birthday, I'm going to have like different things that I do, like bean boozle or Takis, because I can't eat spice. So, Ivy told me to do Takis and vodka. That's disgusting, but I'm going to have like a whole little thing for my birthday. So make sure y'all follow me on Twitch. Just Tasha Gaming. Not they live near you. So I got one body butter left. I got plenty of soap. I got some oils left. Shampoo and conditioner. I still got bath soap. Um, I'm thinking about doing some new stuff too. Coming up for summer. I'm thinking about doing an aloe butter. For like people that go out in the sun. To like help soothe your skin and stuff like that. When you out. Almost like how. I, I don't want to call it like. Uh sunscreen but it'll be like an aloe butter for your skin for like on hot days and stuff like that um i'm thinking about doing face masks but like the powder and then you guys just mix it with water or apple cider vinegar to use it on your face i'm thinking about doing those again um thinking about bringing some face stuff back it just depends on how my sales go the next couple of weeks but because that i was thinking about doing what is a hydroluronic serum um, and face wash and probably some kind of um, some kind of moisturizer some more butters oh yeah I'm also doing um, 
for the girlies who have PCOS or really sensitive skin, I'm doing a neem scrub. So it's going to have like neem powder in it. So it'll be all natural with no fragrance. It'll just be essential oils and like all natural stuff for scrubs for people who can't do the fragrance. So that'll be like a thing to mix I wanted to do a neem butter, but with it already being like 80 degrees in Houston, I used to sell hand sanitizer, but I haven't. The, um, I'd have to buy some to sell it. I don't want to make none though. That's too much. I ain't got time. <laughs> Some stuff already be a process to make, so if it's, like, I have vendors where I can buy stuff and just sell it whole, like, I get it wholesale and can sell it. I haven't bought hand sanitizer in a while, though. I used to have the little, like, how these look for Bath and, from Bath and Body Works. I used to sell these, but I'm out, and I haven't ordered anymore. Just like I got face masks, thinking everybody was still, like, you know, on their COVID thing, and then nobody ever buys the face mask, so they just see here. I think I sent some ass to Monique because I knew she was a nurse and did that with it. They just be sitting here. But I'll keep them for when, when Dream Club coming and make sure I'm stacked because I ain't trying to get COVID again. Appreciate the need, my poor skin. Can't take purchases. Yeah, now I do already have stuff that if you go to my site, I actually made a section for people that have sensitive skin or PCOS. So y'all don't have to look do everything to see what you do so go to sensitive skin slash pcos and everything that's listed here is fragrance free it's only made with natural ingredients and essential oil if it has a fragrance some stuff doesn't have a fragrance at all if it does have a fragrance it's made with essential oil so it's still natural no synthetic fragrances so um like this lux lip scrub with the charcoal the um like the lavender oil the brightening body wash the brightening oil the coffee scrub like all that stuff is natural um the brightening scrub all that stuff under that category is your skin weird you have some spots i get it but yeah that's why i made an area for that especially because my where julio because i remember julio used something on his face that he was supposed to use on his face and then he think his eye got irritated but i'm like if he got fragrance in it like you shouldn't use certain stuff on your face anyway your face and your private parts are like the most sensitive thing on your body so you got to be careful what you put in your face but i think he was putting like lotion on his face and i'm like even if you're a guy don't put lotion on your face like that's what moisturizer is for like you gotta make sure you treat yourself right but yeah i did a new video of my containers so for the scrub i got low profile jars which means they're fatter and they're like wider they're not like the tall ones they like short and fat i like those so they're probably gonna have labels on the top and then for the lotion bottles i went with like a rectangle shape kind of like how this is shaped but like pulled out more so and it's gonna have they're gonna have pumps lotion will dry your face to learn my lotion it depends on the lotion though like if you're using like a shea butter or aloe lotion and it's made naturally it should be good but i just recommend getting a good moisturizer for your face i don't always recommend using lotion especially if you got thin in it you shouldn't do that but i've been working on more recipes though so we'll see what pops off because you know if y'all ain't got no money ain't got no money so we'll see how the sales go i need to be uh whenever i make my new stuff next week i'll do some pictures and do some promo so we'll see how it goes i'll try to promote on instagram and tiktok and see if i get any sales but y'all i got a new soap fragrance coming what else i got and like I said, the neem, I'm going to do the neem in the skirt. Anything for eczema. For eczema, I would recommend you use my oatmeal, milk, and honey soap bar. Because that has colloidal oatmeal in it. So that'll help with like the itching and stuff like that. And then use the rose and calendula body oil for like after. Now I got ashy legs. How do I move that? Put on lotion or butter. Not y'all saying how do you remove ash. You have to be consistent though. That's the thing that helps your skin. Like you need to make sure. See, that's my issue. I'll be transparent with y'all. I know how to do certain stuff and I know what I should do, but I'm not consistent because I don't have time to sit and do it like that. Oh, I didn't turn my cha-chings on. Hold on. Thank you, Pari. Now I got them on, so if anybody orders your cha-ching. But uh, for eczema, oatmeal, milk, and honey soap bar, rose and calendula oil, and then when I make the neem scrub next week, that would be a good scrub. But also the calendula soap bar, that's good for dry skin, eczema, psoriasis. I have a Lux 
Shea Bar. Like, if you have skin conditions, shop under the Sensitive Skin tab. Everything in that tab would help your skin. Itching, hyperpigmentation, dark spots. Um, for the scrubs, you know, they help with, like, um, I was going to say cottage cheese. <laughs> I couldn't even get my words out. I was going to say they help with cottage cheese, y'all. I'm about to just be quiet. I'm finna be quiet. Cellulite. They help with cellulite. I'm finna be quiet. Cottage cheese is crazy. If you have issues with acne, I have a detox soap bar. I would say use that like three times a week. That'll be good. If you doing like the dark mites, anything in the glow section, like glow brightness scrub, um, the glow body wash, the glow body oil, that'll help with like hyperpigmentation and dark spots. I'm not hungry, but you know like when people be ghetto about it, they be calling it like... They be saying uh, cottage cheese, but it's still you like. I do have reviews at the bottom of the page too. I was trying to get it so like I need somebody that's familiar. I need to get like an intern that know how to use Shopify to help me with my store. Cause like people have been leaving um, reviews, but I was trying to get it so like it would show up under the item. But I don't know if it does that. Like I see them at the bottom of the page because I see reviews for the anime lotion too. So I wonder if I click on it. Oh, it does have it on it says one review and then it just scrolls you down so you can see it. Okay. So it shows at the bottom of the page and it shows under the item. That's what I was trying to do. So y'all make sure if y'all order for me and y'all love y'all stuff, make sure y'all leave reviews. That helps for like everybody who ordered that don't know me, they'll know like my products are legit. And hey y'all, I am hungry though. Y'all know it's date day, so I'm ready for Trader to take me out. But I gotta do this stream. I gotta do real talk and then we gotta leave. Then I gotta come back and do my gaming stream. So I need to find some more indie games to play so I can have stuff to put on my um, YouTube channel. Y'all make sure y'all watch my YouTube gaming channel too so I get my views up because I'm almost able to be monetized. I need my watch hours to go up some more though. I need like 170 watch hours under my videos. So when y'all doing laundry and y'all cleaning, y'all just put me on in the background and let my videos play. I got all them playthroughs of Poppy's Playtime and The Walker Dead. Y'all help us sister out. See, I'm just trying to get my money up so I can go big on marketing. Once I go big on marketing, then I feel like I'll be good. But that'd be my issue. But yeah, anything, anything like if you have, like I said, skin issues, um, psoriasis, eczema, just really dry skin. I'm working on more stuff for that too because being diabetic, you get dry skin too. Like a lot of people don't know that you get like really itchy and dry patches and stuff like that when you're diabetic. So I'm working on stuff like that too. But next week, we'll have more lotions with more scents. Um, I'll have the travel size lotions. I'll have more scrubs. I'll have the neem scrub. If the weather permits, I may do a neem butter. So it'll be like, you know, a natural butter that y'all can use too. But we'll, I'll have to see. And I'm gonna have to see about doing a neem oil also. Like an oil with neem powder for your skin. So we'll see. But I'll be trying to, you know what I'm saying? The stuff that have scent is probably like 95% organic. It's just the scent is synthetic, synthetic. So that's the only thing that's synthetic. But everything else, 100% natural because I love y'all. We need to do better. We got to take care of ourselves. Like I seen a video the other day that like Shein and Fashion Nova and all that shit is like killing us the clothes because the clothes are made out of like uh, polyester and then, you know everybody that's making shirts when they press them they press them on polyester because it take better and they was like polyester is like I forgot what it breaks down to but like once your clothes start breaking down like all that stuff like get into your skin and your skin is your biggest organ so that's how they be holding us too like all them chemicals and washing powder and stuff you know like chemicals in the soap like anything you just have to have on your skin your skin is your biggest organ so you gotta take care of it food already be hoeing it so you gotta definitely take care of the outside okay uh joseph thank you for your order and paris and then i have an order from early in the week from andrea or was that yesterday that was yesterday from andrea so thank y'all but yes use the code flash 20 for 20 percent off so i can get rid of some of this stuff before next week and then next week we'll have more items Your products last a long time. I still have shower gel from January and it still smells good. Well, I'm glad. I mean, shower gel can go fast. It just depends on how you use it. Because I know I done ran through two bottles of shower gel in the, in the, the month. But I use a lot of soap when I bath. So, you know, when I take a bath. 
And then let's see. Angel got a brightness scrub and the Love Beard Crush scrub. And then Perry got a lip scrub and a soap. And Joseph got assorted lip balms and two soap bars. So I'm gonna grab their orders in a minute. You love the lip scrub? A now like all my lip scrubs are made the same so they're good but that the one with the charcoal in it is definitely for like if you smoke or do hookah and things like that to help get those toxins you know away from your mouth so that's what that one is good for not that oops twin. <laughs> i hope not you exposing yourself listen I just always just say the first name. I don't be trying to expose y'all whole government and stuff like some people do, but I know most of y'all that order, I know y'all, so for the most part, it be cool. Twin, where have you been? But yeah, y'all order up, order up for you, girl. And like I said, I got new containers, so if y'all want to see the containers I got, they're on my Instagram, the last video that I posted on Instagram. Um, I got the rectangular lotion jars, and then I got the, for the travel size lotions, the bottle is going to squirt, like, uh, like the lotion is kind of going to be a spray, so I have to make sure that it's not, like, real thick. I don't know why that was what came with the lotion bottles that I got, why that was the thing, but I think they have a pump nozzle like they do, um, like, uh, for my oil, so it should be fine, but we'll see. If not, I got extra caps on standby just in case. <laughs> Not that please don't ever say my I know your name when I see your name, so I always try to say Monique because I know you said she don't. <laughs> I remember you saying that. Hey, Adamantium. Not stumbles into chat. But yeah, the only thing I'm trying to get rid of, I have one more butter left, which I would rather send it out this week before it gets hotter. So if anybody wants butter. Um, I got more shower gels. The most that I have are scrubs and body mist. And then I have a couple lotions left. So if anybody wants the lotions, y'all go ham because next week they'll be in new bottles. The only ones I'll probably keep in the same bottles are the, um, the anime lotions. So if y'all didn't hear me next week, I will have a couple anime lotions. I'll have six new scents that I didn't drop with the last one. I'll get those out the way. If I hope I got the label for it, but I got to make the labels and do all that. Y'all be exposing my government name all the time, though. That's because... Danny be doing that. And you seem like you don't have no problem with it. So, you know. But for the most part, when I call out your orders, I just say Adamantium. But yes, I'm trying to make my recipes better. I'm constantly working behind the scenes to make stuff better. Because I know that in our community, a lot of black people just buy stuff. Because, oh, it smells good. It smells good, yes. But is it good for you? Like, I try to make my stuff good for you, and I try to make it smell good. So, you know, got to take care of your skin, and you can smell good. You do that together. I'm also thinking about uh, doing a natural deodorant, but I think I'm going to try it on myself first to see. Because it's going to be uh, baking soda free and aluminum free. Like, it won't have any of those chemicals in it. And I know that's not going to work for everybody, especially if you've never done aluminum free deodorant before. Hey, Slim. Real, 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 real. But, uh... I'm going to try. Would I be selling any more coffee mugs? I'm thinking about it. And I'm thinking about doing anime tumblers. But I don't know when I'm going to do it. Because I want to do the anime tumblers when I drop another collection of uh, anime lotion. If that makes sense. So that way the people that's coming for the lotion can kind of get a tumbler too. If that makes sense. So I'll, have, I'll probably have more drinkware during the summer. The YouTube gaming channel. It should be under just Tasha Gaming. But I'll give you the link. Real, 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 real. I'll drop my links for y'all. But yes, y'all run it up for your girl. <laughs> it's free to watch my videos. So if you can't support the store, y'all go to my gaming channel and watch my videos because I'm only 170 hours away from being able to be monetized on my gaming channel, which is awesome. So if y'all don't follow me, Y'all subscribe, you know what I'm saying, turn the bell on. I be trying to be more consistent. I did Poppy's Playtime. I did Season 2 of The Walking Dead. I did The Exit 8. I have a couple of grocery store videos. I did Little Nightmares. I got to post the end of that. Resident Evil Village should all be there. 
Um, I think I got War War Z episodes that are old, Seven Days. I got random games, of course. And then um, I post shorts and stuff, too. Uh, so what are some products you're really trying to get rid of? I want to get rid of my lotions because next week I'll have new lotions. Um, but the stuff I really want to get rid of is probably my bath soaks, my shampoo and conditioner, and yeah, the scrubs and lotions. That'll probably, everything else is like, it is what it is. But I'll have new stuff next week, so I'm trying to get rid of this stuff here that I got. The lotions and the scrubs. Lotion, scrub, shampoo and conditioner, and my bath soaps. Um, I need to redo my page on my game and channel too, but and put some more categories on there. I haven't updated it. And then if y'all need my Twitch, so y'all can come hang out with us on Fridays. On Fridays night is community night, so I try to play games where all of y'all can participate. And then lately i've been watching of uh, 911 and Grey's anatomy after the stream so if you ain't into gaming you still could just come and hang out and then watch stuff too because i'll be over there watching stuff also i'll be doing sponsor streams we've been we've been on some games you know what i'm saying so y'all come hang out be a part of the community y'all don't always have to talk to people i get it everybody don't like talking y'all could just come in like and sit in the chat it's okay i'm all right with that i used to be that person too i like and people chat i don't like talking to everybody so Ooh, I wish I could give games away. They got a bus simulator, 21, next stop. I wish I could give games away, but I think when they give them to you with Amazon Prime, you have to, like, direct download. I can't give it away, because I would have gave this to Ivy. She probably would have played this, the bus simulator. Um, but this is my Twitch I own 300 lotions from this store. I'm shining like Easter ham. That's crazy. Now, why Trey tell me last minute he wanted to cook for Easter? He was like, I had bought a turkey a couple of weeks ago. And then he was like, he was going to do the turkey for they, I mean, for uh, for Easter. So, you know, I got to do dressing. So, I need to check and see what I got in there. So, I can go to the store tomorrow and get the stuff and cook it. I don't mind doing that, I guess. But, you know. I talk all the time. Wait, I talk all the time. Oh, you hooked me on Grey's Anatomy. Grey's Anatomy is good. I'm telling y'all, when I have free time to watch stuff, we are definitely going to start from the beginning because those first, like, six to seven seasons are amazing, okay? Thank you, Martin. Let me start uh, grabbing some of y'all stuff. Oh, y'all proud of me? I went to the doctor, like, two weeks ago. So I lost, like, four more pounds. And then my A1C dropped from 7.1 to 6.1. So I've been doing really well, y'all. Not that I'll be talking about grades. Yes, we was talking about grades. Um, and... Not who's making dressing and greens. I ain't making no greens, but I'm making some dressing to go with this turkey tray guy. Strawberry looks good. And um, lip balm, sugar balm, and strawberries. Every time So of course Shopify holds me yet again. So what I'm gonna have to do Martin Cause they, I don't know why they had six soaks on here. I only have five. I'm gonna give you some free, um, some free African black soap with your order because of that. I'm gonna give you a big chunk. Found you a bigger bar. 
And now, matter of fact, I'm gonna give you two bars. Hold on. Yeah, don't forget too. I do have. Did I not? I should have put my African black soap on the sensitive skin thing. I don't know why I didn't do that. Let me change that too. Cause that is also good. Now with the African black soap, if y'all ever get that, make sure you lather in your hand and then use it on your face or body. And then make sure you use a good moisturizer after because it will dry out your skin. Like it'll help you with your acne and clear that shit right on up. But make sure you got a good moisturizer and make sure you don't put it directly on your skin. track with the sales maybe I can get thank you for the order I'll get enough funding to where I can put money into like actually branding my stuff so like I could go get a company right and I could do this the color I want oh this match my groovy and then I could get like self-care self-love on it written so like when y'all get stuff the boxes and the bags will be like branded already uh Christian, thank you for your order. Oh, you got the last Valentine's on the thank you. Somebody finally got it. I'm also going to try to redo my office. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get it done before my birthday. But I know by May, I'm going to have a different desk because I need more space. And then this desk behind me, I'm probably going to like put it on the side. And then I'm probably gonna have all my products behind me so that way when y'all call when y'all I was gonna say when y'all call in. That way when y'all order, y'all can like actually see the stuff. So we'll we'll see how it goes. It's gonna take a little time because I'm gonna have to move all this stuff around. It's definitely gonna take me some weeks. Um let's see. Do I have to pay a lot of taxes for my business? Um, that's a complicated question because for, for like taxes, like income taxes, me and Trey always owe. And then because this is like an LLC and what we do with videos, I put them together. So like they kind of, whatever we owe, we owe for both businesses. So, you know, cause the first time I did taxes for that was last year, but I haven't had a refund in like, since like 20, 2019. <laughs> so yeah. We, we owe but like um I have to pay um what do you call it uh I have to pay like sales tax to Texas like it depends on what state you're in some people charge you taxes depending on what kind of business you operate in blah 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 so the sales tax that I make like I have to make sure I file and pay that each month I don't know why it's each month it's month sure if you guys order though you're welcome i love this it's all oh, thank you but yeah just make sure if you order you use the code flash 20 so you can get 20 percent off your order and then next week i will be back with some new hardness
Wait, what mistake you made several times? You recommend Garden of Bonbon and Bloodwash? I have Garden of Bonbon because some of these games are like shorter. I was going to do them like not on stream, but just like standalone games. Um, Let me see what I got because they had some free games. I think the Garden of Bonbon was free at the time, so I got the whatever the free version is, but I have I have Welcome to the Game. I want to play that, but I'm so scared because they got to do a dark web stuff. I don't know about that one. I may have to do that one on stream, so I'm not alone. Uh, did I get? I got something called Missing Hiker. And then I have Garden of Bon Bon. Yeah, I got that on here. And then I need to download that Shin, whatever. It's supposed to be a game like the XA8 that's out now. I need to get whatever that is. It's like Shin and something zero. Shin. I don't know what it is. Hey, Julio. Yeah, I'm slick back today. I ain't feel like doing an extra. I need to actually wash it and detangle it and probably like twist it up. Yeah, I was thinking about getting a stamp done, but I'm going to wait and see what God got in store for me because, you know, I could get blessed and blessed. Yeah, it's the one on the train. What's the name of that Adam and Tim? Oh, you, yeah. And y'all got to pay attention to the directions because I'll be putting them on there, but I know you be busy, Mark. But yeah, because like it's African soap, so it's made with different ingredients. So you don't want anything in it to like scratch your face. So you definitely got to lather first and then use it. But it's going to work though. But yeah, you got to lather up first. I need to wash my too, but I don't want to. I don't know the name of this game. And I don't even know if it's on Steam, to be honest. But I know it's like the X8, but it's on like a subway train. So I need to get that too, so I can play it. I need to do another grocery store video for y'all. I need to start doing a Stardew segment on uh, my solo Stardew. I need to start doing that on, um, I don't know. I feel like people like those games sometimes, but we'll see. This place I get my mailers from, they can do custom mailers, but I just feel like anything made in America gonna be high as fuck. Y'all ever seen Body Cam with Mary J. Blige? I knew of the movie, but I don't feel like I watched it though. What am I looking for? Okay, yeah. Shipping label, shipping tape. I think I ordered tank and I ordered, you know what? I already ordered shit. I be forgetting I be ordering shit from different places. I forgot I ordered um, pack of peanuts already. So I just need boxes. That's 75 boxes, that should be good enough. But, but I'll get that. Not you, not you. Oh, I'm honored you called Beyonce for me. I'm so honored. Don't forget, I do have gift cards if y'all want to gift the love of self care to somebody else. You can get a gift card and it'll email you a code that you can give them. The game is called Shinkansen Zero. So I wonder if that's like an indie game. I don't see that on stream. Like I would not indie, but I wonder if it's on some. 
it's a chillers art game. It is on Steam, so not it. So why didn't it pop up? Cause you gotta type chillers art in the front first. That's crazy. And that shit is six ninety nine. Damn. And then freedom over it. Huh. What else I got in my cart? What the fuck is home safety hotline? What is this? Did somebody tell me to get this? Home safety hotline? Did we talk about this before? <laughs> Look up like, did we talk about this? Hey, you on break? Hopefully your work day is going fine. I got something called home safety hotline in my cart. I don't know what the fuck this is. Yeah, I got a slip back. I had to put that, uh, what you call that, that gel? The one that hold the wigs? <laughs> I got some of that gel on today instead of the Eco Styler. Because Eco Styler don't do nothing but make my hair look wavier. It don't be holding nothing down. I put the wig when I... <laughs> I forgot the name of it, bro. <sighs> hey, Simski. Not me exiting out of this shit. Like, I ain't got to look at the orders and see what to do. I forgot the damn name of it though. Let me start with these orders I got though. Uh, so brightness scrub and love bear crush for Andrea. You got ten minutes, but I'll be back in one fifteen. Okay. Oh, you got something to tell me? What happened? You sound like you about to... I wish Lizzie was in here, y'all, so she could tell y'all what happened at her job, because that was crazy at the Walmart. The work from home, folks. That was crazy. I need to make sure I get some candy. Uh, you know what? This actually is too big. This box is too big. I don't know. Thank you, Andrea, if you're here. One day I'm gonna get one of those Shopify counters so that every time y'all order, y'all can see the counter move in the back. I shouldn't have stayed until this said album. What time are you playing there by the like? Um, I don't know, cause I don't know where we're going to eat today. So I'm gonna say around like eight-ish hour time, cause I know that's not what I'm starting with. But um, I'm gonna say like around eight though. Cause if I start streaming at seven, I know I'm doing words on stream, and I don't know what else first, but I'll try to do that by daylight around eight. Um, whose order is next? Powdery. You got the strawberry lip scrub, and you got the champagne mimosa. So this is so pretty. I wish y'all could like see it. The light be holding me every time though. Thank you, Potty. I'm gonna tape up your bottle just in case this is gonna be a little real quick. If not time for me to take a nap, excellent, please. Every time you say excellent, I think about the dude from the symptoms that be like excellent. Mr. Burns, that'd be so funny. If your business gets big, hopefully you get to the open a physical store or you're not trying to go there. Um, I, let me tell you what I learned. Because I did want to open a physical store. Now, I probably will get me a location separate from the house to actually make stuff in. To do lives and pack orders and stuff like that. But I do think I want to stay online only because there's so much more costs that come with having a physical location. That I've seen people who sell out so much online open a physical location they have to close it and go back to online because of how eager it is so i feel like i would definitely because you got rent and all your bills on top of taxes and all that kind of shit so i just feel like i'll probably stay online only not i'll live in the store please Who get bitch today? I don't eat this. I'm gonna 
praise the Lord though. Um, thank you again, Patty. Now that I work for the front desk. But if I don't have an extra location, how you gonna work for the front desk? Not how much you want for rent. Y'all doing the most. I cannot. Not the back of the store like Quasimodo. But I wouldn't even pay people seven dollars though, because I know I wouldn't want to make that. Like if I can't pay somebody to work for me at least fifteen dollars an hour, I'm not doing it. Like I know what it's like to live in Texas. I wouldn't dare pay anybody anything under twelve dollars. Like, mm -mm. I wouldn't do that to people. I've worked since I've been here, and even my starting pay, ten plus years ago when we moved here, was like ten dollars. I've never made under that in Texas. I've never made under, and it only kept going up. When I started working for Chase, I made thirteen. When I started making for Geico, I made sixteen. Then I started working for myself. Now can I sit in the window like a display? Why are y'all built like this, bro? I'm tired. I'm so tired. Danny. Danny, well, I told them earlier I hold myself on the fishing game because when I played with y'all and made the clan, I should have left it open because now I can't get in that account because it was on computer. They started my stuff over, so I don't know how to get to be, like, I don't know how to go back in the account. So, you know, um, yeah. So whoever's in there is in there. I can't add nobody else. Not pay me in products and I'll be good. But it was fine when I played the first couple of days because, like, I could get in there fine. But it's like, now I can't get in. And you did yours on phone, though. I can still get in my phone account. I'm talking about the one on the computer because on the computer, it don't save unless you, like, log in. Because when I do the computer, it's just to show y'all because I don't know how to stream from my phone. So... Uh, my phone account is in the clan though but it's just I'm not in control of anything so it's just it is what it is and I'm gonna need them to actually like do the stuff right because I've been keeping track of who been doing what and they they hoing me out of stuff 25 of y'all did the level 5 oh thank you for the order and I know at least 7 people made it to level 50 and they like I'm going to need that shit to update. I need it to update immediately. Running through that game. We was running through. Oh. Not y'all coming through like that. Who is that? Denise. Thank you, Denise, for your order. I appreciate it. Make sure y'all use the code, uh... Flash 20 for 20% off. I had to think about it for a second. You're on level 60. Let me see what level I am. I be leveling up because I be doing them championships and they be giving me them packs. That's how I be living my best life. I do them championships and be getting like four and five packs from them. Look at there. I just got like, that's six packs I just got. Then they gave me 30 pearls for free. Lures received. Oh, yeah, I forgot y'all gave me some lures. In the clan, y'all can ask people for lures, too, if y'all didn't know. Because, like, some of the fish, I couldn't find, like, the other car for. And I didn't know you could ask for them in the, in the clan. So, make sure y'all do that, too. I'm on level 51 on my phone. And... Let me see. They really be trying to hold us, though. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven people. Yeah, seven people made this 1150. Cat and Mystic and K are right at, no, that's eight people that made this 1150. And then it's like three people that's right at 1150. So I'm not going to close my campaign until like Sunday. Okay, OD. I'm not going to, um, not paid in black excellence. <laughs> what the fuck? I appreciate y'all. Cat is one level away. Mystic is two. And K, K is one. And whoever Young Dragon is is two. And Deacon is one. So that's like about four people that's about to be low 50. So I'm going to need them to rub my coins when this campaign over. Because what we're not going to do is act like the realists did not come and show out for these uh, promotions that I was doing. I 
I was gonna play it again tonight with y'all in case somebody else wanted to join, but then I can't even add people to the clan, so like, I don't want people to feel bad if they play, but then they can't join us, so I might not even play it no more on stream, so I don't know. I can't get back into the account, though, to, to let people in the clan. Y'all are amazing though. The way y'all be supporting me and Trey. I told Trey he need to do a sponsor for like one of the Marvel games. Cause some of the guys probably are like getting to play with him more so with the Marvel stuff. That should have said no, maybe some shit, but I'm addicted to it. So I guess the autocorrect was right. Well, I'm glad you like it. And if y'all order from me, don't be scared to go and leave reviews on the on the website under the product that y'all bought. I appreciate it. That'll help out with people who don't know me to know that I'm actually legit and not selling them no lies. I need to be on my TikTok more too. I be having too much stuff to do, bro. It would be hard to keep up with some of this sometimes. Level 53. All these damn cars I gotta level up. I'll be taking all my coins. I need to figure out how you trigger boss fish because that be how you level up your your regular lure to catch everything. I don't be getting no boss fish like that though. I got a level five ribbon for the Amazon. I haven't caught a legendary fish yet, I don't think. Omega. Omega, I need to make you some creamy coconut stuff before we go to Dream Code and need to bring it or send it to you. If I don't get a chance to send it to you before then, I'll bring it with me. Every time I look at that fragrance, I'll be thinking about you, but then I'll be forgetting to like make it and send it. <laughs> Danny, so you unlocked uh, the Great Barrier Reef. That's where you at. That's what I'm trying to get to. <laughs> now I don't watch straight because my ears get blown now. I need my ears to work. I mean, that's what turning the volume down is for. Imagine not doing that. Um, oh yeah, I see it now in the chat. Damn, Miss Carter unlocked the eighth one, whatever the eighth one is. God damn, y'all is out here cutting up.
catching sharks was catching me off guard, bitch. Catching sharks and piranhas and alligators and shit. I was like, um, the fuck? All right, Martin, let me do your order with these bad folks. See, like these boxes, if I can't get them custom done, I might get a bunch of these and just get me a custom stamp and stamp on the inside and the outside. So they be customized when they come to y'all. But we gonna see. I wanna start making my own lip glosses too, but I don't wanna like overdo it, making stuff and don't have time. So we'll see. All right, I got your bad soap and your African black soap in here. I don't know if I want to do samples at Green Coming this year. I did it last year, but some of them hoes got them on their ears, but we'll see. If I feel like making some, I might make some and, and give them all like I did last time, but they're lost if I don't. Wait, <laughs> the way I skipped over a whole order, I can't read. I skipped over uh, Joseph's order with the lip balm and both soaps. I apologize. I got you right here. Lip balm kit. I do have uh, another lip balm kit and I have lip gloss as well. Sugar plum soap and strawberries and champagne soap. Thank you. This pen. I don't like them. And then we got Christian with the strawberries and champagne. Valentine's set. Thank you for your order. Let's see who we got. Kelly, thank you so much for ordering. Um, like I was letting them know before you came in, Kelly, I will have a couple more anime scents next week. If anybody wants some, I would have six different scents. So I'll have 18 total because I normally do three for each one. So I'll have 18 anime lotions next week. Um, hey, Jelani. Um, I will also have some more sensitive skin and regular items next week. I'm making a scrub that has neem powder in it. I wanted to do a butter, but I should have like found a recipe before it got hot. So I'll have to wait until the fall to do like neem butter. But I am gonna have a neem scrub. I might do a neem oil, I'm gonna see. I will have travel size lotions next week and more stuff. I got new containers I wanted to try, so we are gonna see how it goes. and pick up more candy or either I need to buy more popcorn from that company so I can make sure I got popcorn to last for the next month or two with these orders. And uh, that was for Christian. What time is it? Let me call my son real quick.
And then we doing real talk today, so I'm gonna go wake Trip. That Baku lo that Baku go lotion was bomb, really. Okay. <laughs> and who I got after Christian Denise? So what you got, Denise? Denise got a lip gloss. Stop scratching on my carpet before we fight. And then Kelly got two champagne mumbles. All right, Denise, I got your soap bars. I got your Yoni soap bar, which this this one can be used face and body. But if you need to use it for your poom poom, lather, take your hand and rub it down, make sure you clean well. Um, it has pH balancing uh, stuff in there. And then this is the turmeric and carry bar, it can be used on face and body. I got your coconut lip scrub, which I do not have a label on for whatever reason. Sorry about that. <laughs> and I got your lip gloss, I got you a pink one. Hopefully, you like pink. They all do the same thing, it's just they just came in different colors. Thank you, Miss Denise. And Kelly, I got your shower gels. So, Kelly got the champagne mimosa. Shower, gel, body wash, or whatever y'all want to call them. They smell like amazing. Thank you, Kelly. Thank you, Kelly. Appreciate you guys the mostest. week oh if anybody is a butter banded in the chat 20% off butter and it already was discounted anyway because I don't want it to melt bad after this week but uh I have a strawberry pound cake butter left online if anybody wants it I got the one left and I got two scented body oils left um I got one brightness scrub and then I got these lotions if anybody needs lotions I got one galactic skies I got sweet cream Rainbow Sherbet, Oatmeal Milk and Honey, and um, Ice Lemon Cake Lotion left. Because I'll have new bottles next week.
not pH balance for her, but strong enough for him. I'm tired. The only time I watch RTTV is when Beyonce releases something. Ah, not you bringing them up just to say that. Not you handled a crackhead with a gun this week. Ah. If anybody has questions, though, if there's something you want to try or order and you're not sure, feel free to ask. I'm okay with that. I'll get you right. Let me know what you need, and I'll point you in the right direction. Let me eat a couple of my... <coughs> the disrespect of this ginger snap jumping out and hitting me and hitting the floor. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. You know what? If I get a new desk, I'm going to hate it not having drawers because of all the snacks and stuff I be having in my drawers. Fuck. I'm going to have to like find another alternative. I don't know. It's Trey's day to pick and he wasn't sure earlier. So I'm just going to be surprised. As long as it's good, I'm okay with whatever. Because we ate ramen last week. He meant I want to go back. I'm okay with going every week to the ramen place. Because they food always fire. The consistency don't ever change. So I'm okay with going back. I be trying to go to places where I can spend $100 or less on date night. So I'm okay with whatever. Every now and then we can get a little bougier than that. But I don't be trying to spend all that money, okay? Because I like to eat on Friday and Saturday. So the less I eat on Friday, the less it costs. Then I can go eat on Saturday. <laughs> that pH balance quote. Oh, yeah, because I brought up the lotion. I mean, not the lotion, the soap that has, like, pH balance and stuff. Uh, I need to check on my Amazon orders. Let me see. I'm going to have hair oil for y'all, too. I forgot about that. I'm going to have hair oil for y'all. I fucking forgot. I found my Indian Ayurvedic herbs that I wanted. So, I'm going to, um, what's the word? I don't know the word I'm looking for. But I'm going to make the oil ahead of time so I can, um, so it can, like, steep. I guess the herbs can, like, steep in the oil. And y'all get all those benefits and stuff before I make it for Friday. But yes, I'm going to have hair oil. Yes, I got my Indian Are You Verdict oil, oils. I mean, herbs. Um, I got the tea tree, rosemary, um, cherry kernel. Uh, was it Gracie? No, uh, castor oil, yeah. So the base for that oil is going to be castor oil. So it's going to be castor oil. Uh, I'm trying to remember the recipe. Castor oil, cherry kernel oil, uh, rosemary and tea tree, and then it's gonna have those Indian herbs in it. So it should do like a multitude of things. Not collect nickels and pennies, please. Yeah, you on level eight, Miss Carter. I just looked in the clan and seen it. But yes, I forgot about that. So hair oil next week too. Had to make a comeback. I need to send my grandma some too. My grandma and my mama. Cause that diabetes be having their scalp itchy. I said itchy and you came out around the corner. Your scalp itchy? What's, what's going on? You good? If y'all can see how God was standing at me right now, like, I don't know what we want to talk about. What's wrong? You okay? You okay? Are you okay? Any are you okay? Are you okay? Any?
Oh, that's what's up, Kelly. Oh, your planner. I think I got one left. Those um, wait, which planner did you get? Do I have? I got so much stuff everywhere. I didn't know you made a coffee scrub. I love coffee, and I might have to snag. I did coffee scrubs because coffee helped with cellulite. And then plus, with it smelling like coffee, because coffee's in it, I don't have to scent it with anything, so it's like 100% natural. Ooh, not y'all talking about RTTV up in here, please. Wait, I bought some La Roche. Why I read that as La Roche Pussy? <laughs> I literally read it as La Roche Pussy. I was like, what? I thought you was trying to be funny. I didn't know that was like a real thing. I was like, what is it? He said I bought some La Roche Pussy sunscreen. I was like, what is that? <laughs> I bought some good dupes in, for fragrance oil for next month. Hopefully it comes in time. If not, I probably won't release all my lotion at one time. I might save some for when I get my um my fragrance oil. Cause I got that um Let me look and see what the hell did I get before I lie. I know I'm coming out with a good vanilla scent because I know some of y'all love vanilla. So I got a good vanilla scent that's coming for the rest of summer. And uh, let me look up the name of this other one. It's some kind of rouge. I got to figure out what I want to name it though. Mm. Baccarat Rouge 540. I don't know who scent that's it, that is, but I, I got like a dupe of that. I'm going to make that too. I don't know whose shit that is. Let me Google it. Baccarat Rouge 450. Yeah, it's called Baccarat Rouge. Do they sell it at your job, Omega? <laughs> I forgot who, what brand it is. Not, I love that shit. Yeah, I got, I got that. I got the dupe for it. I've been trying to get dupes for like more popular scents. Cause let me tell y'all what the fuck Bath and Body Works did, bitch. I guess sales must be slow at Bath and Body Works. I ain't trying to promote them, but I see what they did. So like all the good fancy perfumes that people buy, they made perfume dupes as like body spray at, at Bath and Body Works. They came out with them. I don't know if y'all see that or not. Let me go to bathandbodyworks.com and see how they got it on here. Cause they literally, where is it at? I seen somebody do a review of that shit on fucking TikTok. They got a whole section where it's body mist, but they all dupes of like famous stuff. So you gotta figure out what it is though, because of course the name not gonna implicate what it is. But I gotta figure out how to name it, cause I ain't trying to get clapped. But I definitely got what is it, Mason Francis, Kirk, Kirk Dijon, <laughs> Baccarat Rouge 450. I mean 540. I got that, and then what else did I get? Hold on. <laughs> Nah, I'm, oh, why well, I thought you said, yep, milk, like naming milk. I was about to be like, please. My brain is like all over the place today. Hold on, let me see what else I got. Because if I bought the wrong thing, I'm about to be hurt. I'm trying to make my sense more popular. Like, they can seem like they upscale, but like smell like those, but still be dupes. So... I'll have to definitely do a body spray for Baccarat Rouge if it does good. But for most things I come out with, they be lotions first. And I'm going to do sample sizes whenever I get it. But we'll see. Um, where is the place where I log in at, though? Is Am I logged in? Is it me? Hello, am I here? Okay, there we go. Bad that body works trying to be like the scent, the old scent shops. Child, when money get low, they go. Let me see orders and tracking, <laughs> pending shit. Man, I hope it don't take them thirty-seven years to ship my shit. What did I get? I think this is. A, 
this might be a famous one too. Um, it's called Simply Vanilla. And no, it's vanilla. Vanilla. I don't know how to say it because it's not vanilla. It's like Vanilla Forty Four. It's an alt fragrance, A L T. I got the dupe for that too, cause I feel like that would be like a good vanilla scent, and then it's like a bougie scent. So, but yeah, it's called Vanilla Forty Four. Paris Le Labo. <laughs> I don't know where these names of these perfumes, bro. But I got the dupes for they motherfucking ass. I'ma show y'all. Like I'ma be out here in these streets, okay? I got I got a marshmallow fragrance or two, cause I like marshmallows. I wanna try that. So depending on not Le Labo Fire too. See, I'm about to about to have a game on lock. I'm gonna start doing what everybody else be doing. I'm gonna start getting these bougie scents and then getting the dupe and, and go ahead about my business. So yeah, that way I can put that in my my description that that's what that's what it's a dupe of, but not affiliated with that company. I like marshmallows, so I'm going to have to decide if I want to keep doing the sweet cream or if I want to do marshmallow. I'm going to see which one I like the best, and then I'm going to go with that. But, yes, uh, I got something to try it out and see how it goes. So, it'll be lotion first and scrub first, probably, before anything else. And then I'll probably do sample sizes, and then I'll probably do body mist and shower gel if the scent is, like, good and everybody likes it. But, yes, I'm trying to be in these streets. You never walk them to so that's supposed to be like bath and body work i just sit outside and have a one too wait what bb oh you talking about, about like bath and body work it's bbw <laughs> oh miss car please So if I can do the bougie perfumes and I can do the animation, we finna be, we finna have the game on lock. 2024 about to be my year, y'all. Y'all gonna see me go from not on BBW, but it's bad that body worked up. They be saying I'm BBW too, but you know. But yes, yeah, I'm about to have the game on lock. I'ma go from 10 orders a week to about 100 a week. A thousand. Y'all gonna see me sweating. I'm gonna be putting out applications. Anybody wanna come work? <laughs> you know what else I got dupes for though? Let me see. Cause my stupid ass don't be saying that they dupe. One of the anime scents that I'm coming out with, I forgot what character I have it for. It's called Rio Radiance for me, but it's a it's a dupe of the Sol de Janeiro scent that everybody be liking, them Brazilian scents. So I got a dupe of that. And then... bum bum scent that i used last summer when i used the bum bum stuff that's a that's a, a dupe of uh, a soul de janeiro scent too i just don't know which one like them they be having them bum bum creams and like alta and sephora and stuff i probably need to start like putting it on there so people can notice what it is but if you got a good nose for that stuff people will know anyway I gotta start um, looking at some of these scents closer too, cause I noticed that 
the scent companies are starting to have to put Prop 65 complaints because of California. Like, if they have anything in it that could, like, lead to cancer or be carcinogenic, then, um, oh, you sent me a tip on Streamlabs. Ah, cool. I got to start paying attention to that, too, because I don't want to do none of that, too. If it has, like, Prop 65 issues, I don't want to use it. Thank you for the tip. Oh my boy. I didn't even know. Because it don't pop up for this stream. But thank you so much. I appreciate it Kelly. That oatmeal milk and honey smells amazing though. I ain't gonna never stop selling that. But yeah, the bum bum fragrance that I sold last summer. Um to find if I do a lavender and I do it as lotion and stuff I want to find something that's like a bougie that got lavender in it so I can get a dupe of it and do that I usually do lavender vanilla though but I haven't sold that in a minute I sold out can you ask some business cards in my order I need them I'm out of business cards I'm actually waiting on more to come in so I don't have them yet hopefully I'll have some next week Now we live in cancer here in California. But California was the one who I thought started that prop stuff though. So like they have to let you know if there's something cancer in it or in the making of it or whatever. I don't know if I should get the rose oil or lavender. If you're doing it just based off how it smells since it's oil and you like lavender, do the lavender one. <laughs> and then if you put it on before bed, it probably will help you sleep. I do the rose and calendula more so for people that have like, um, you know, like eczema and dry skin and stuff like that. That calendula helps calm down like dry, itchy skin. But if you're just doing it for the smell, do the lavender. Hmm. 
Hmm. Omega, I'm going to have to start asking you what popular fragrances they have at, uh, at your job so I can see if I can find dupes of the stuff that smell really good. Cool. Oh, what's the Biba La Juicy? <laughs> what the fuck is that? I got that Vanilla 44 though and that Baccarat Rouge. Let me see what else. Saint Laurent um, dupe. <clears throat> it's called Libre. I don't know how that smells though. I have to look up where the dupe is from because they don't put it on here. But I can tell when they have the little star by it. It's a dupe of something. But they got the Eve, the Eve Saint Laurent, and it's called Libre. Floral and feminine in the most classic way. Tart red current dances with sweet mandarin and dazzling bergamot. Or orange flower and jasmine glide above rich vanilla, sleepy sandalwood, and quiet amber. Hmm. And then Juicy Couture is Villa Juicy. Probably would literally just call that juicy, but not <laughs> you use YSLY. I don't know the rest. That's the name of it. Let me see. Oh, is it called Why Not? Or is it? I think it's just called Why. It's literally a Y on it. Like, not the word Y. They have, like, the letter Y. It's called, that's the name of it, Why? It's called a big ass Why. Let me see if they got that on here. So that's a male scent. Let me see. I wonder how pineapple mango smell. I be wanting to get tropical for summer. And I want me like a good pineapple scent, but I don't know. Pineapple mango seemed like it would smell really good. Um, if you're looking for a soap, the turmeric is for like dark spots. Like how I have, if you have like acne spots or you got like discoloration or something like that, that's what the turmeric and carrot soap would be for. But you could use it on your face regardless to help with acne and stuff too. But it's mostly for discoloration and stuff. Are you looking for like, you just looking for like a soap for the body or like something for your face specifically? Oh, what the fuck does pink watermelon apricot smell like? Oh my god, these sound like drinks. <laughs> Wait, ooh. See, this is my thing. I be too, like, ADHD with it. I be trying to get everything, and I can't do that. I need to get, like, a good set list of what I'm going to have for summer and just stick to it because I be all over the place. I need to restock some more baby powder, too. Yeah, if it says glow, then that's all, like, brightening stuff. So, like, if you were trying to... Um, get rid of like dark spots and, and stuff like that then you would use that like the turmeric soap the turmeric oil the shower gel or the scrub would be the stuff you do for like um, hyperpigmentation or just scars and spots and things like that 
I mean, you can use it daily if you want. There's nothing wrong with it because the tumor gets safe enough to use on your face and your body. It's just a matter of what you want to use it for. But that's more so like, you know, you got like, you know how people have like dark spots on their arms from shaving and stuff like that? That's the kind of stuff you will use every day to try to fade those spots out. Yeah, if you ask Razzle, she uses scrubs every day, but I would I would just do maybe two to three times a week because it's gonna just have your skin raw probably. But I try to make my scrubs gentle enough to use a lot. Should I only use a scrub in African soap different days? Mm, I wouldn't say that because the African soap is gonna dry you out and then the scrub is gonna add moisture because it was in it so you can use them on the same days if you want it's just a pen but I mean the African soap are you using it on your face or body because I want to use the scrub on your face like if you're using the African black soap Yeah, the scrub is for the body. Now, some people sell facial scrubs, but I don't feel like you necessarily have to do that. Like, I feel like if, if especially if you're using that African black soap, you should be good for your face. Just make sure you got a good moisturizer and then the scrub is for the body. tobacco leaf for I never understood the cigar smells tobacco and, and all that, and leather I don't want to smell no fucking tobacco and leather but I guess some people do Coco Mademoiselle who make that that sound bougie hold on I know that's a dupe that's Chanel hmm Coco Mademoiselle by Chanel. If anybody here wishes to order, please don't forget to use the code FLASH20 for 20% off. Damn, they got a mango peach too. Mango peach and mango pineapple. Why do you do beers look like black beers? I need to use up all the other fragrance oils I got first before I be trying to buy all these new ones. That's what I need to do. <laughs> I need to just like fill up my shelves so I don't have to restock for a while instead of doing shit every month and just add what I need. I might need to start doing that. <laughs> Lemon rose water. Whoa. But yeah, I got a lot of projects that I'm trying to work on. I want to make bath tea bags, like where you put the bag in the bath and it turns your water into like tea basically for like health reasons. And then you can just take the bag out without having to fish all the shit back out the tub. Um, then like I said, I was working on um, odor neutralizing deodorant, but I gotta see. I don't know. I know deodorant gonna be hit or miss, but I'm gonna have to see. Cause it'll be baking soda free and it'll be aluminum free and I'll just have to see I'm gonna try one or make one and try for myself first and see how I feel about it if I wear it all day and stuff doing various activities I want to make a new soap but if I do the cold process soap it's gonna take like a month before I can sell it but I might go and make it anyway we'll see I want to try champagne kisses I'm gonna see how that smells Sparkling bubbles of crisp champagne. Blended with tangy grapefruit, champagne, grapes, and deep plum. It might be another name for some shit I already got, though, but I'm gonna see. 
but I thought that I might do that because I want to do the matching body wash, but it's going to actually be in a champagne bottle. I to get my game up out here in these streets. And I do want to do a hydroluronic serum. That's going to be a process though. that takes like six plus hours to make. Not that it's hard. I just have to let it sit. But we'll see. And I need to give me some distilled water too. And I need to give me a preservative. Some hydroluronic acid powder. Face mask. And then for the face cream and for the face cleanser, I don't know. I'm gonna see though. I think I'm gonna do a foam and cleanser and a regular moisturizer and a hydroluronic serum together. Did your order go through? It probably did. My phone be behind. Thank you. You got the brightness scrub and then you got the rose and calendula. Not you saying all that about lavender just to get the other one, please. Got you a lip gloss. Oh wait, this a lip plumper. Let me not put that on you like that. I'm gonna give you one of these bath bombs too. I thought this was regular lip gloss. I'm glad I looked at this because your lips would have been probably bigger than Kylie's, and you would have been cussing me out. I forgot to cook these up and like make little sample bags of all this different cook. Now that I put that on while I'm looking and wonder why it's spicy. sample of this cotton candy so I'll be, I'll be having the ends left and then I'll be forgetting to like cut them up and put them in people order with air samples probably should have did that to a lot of y'all I'll be slacking I'm sorry If anybody likes bath bombs, I do have three left of the oatmeal, milk, and honey. They smell amazing. Thank you, OD, for your order. I got your brightening scrub. I got your oil. I got your bath bomb and your soap sample. And I put you some fake nails in here because they just sitting here in my house. again OD
So I'm gonna try to do that to y'all and start sending y'all so fancy. I didn't do it because I didn't label them how I wanted. So y'all would have got a so simple and not knowing what the fuck it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to make more cotton candy and more baby powder stuff. I gotta stop slacking. Wanna be on top? That's gonna be me this year. With my lotion. Wanna be on top? You stepped up your skincare routine lately so you can shine for drink time. Child, it's gonna be what it is when I get there. I just wanna have fun and not be smushed to death in the lines. Anybody tried um, Taraji's hairline? I wanted to kind of try her stuff because I actually see her using it. And I don't think it's like real expensive. But I haven't um, heard nobody really say they used her stuff before. So I wonder if it's good or not. Next time I have to buy hair stuff, I wanted to try hers. That's why I be like, I be inconsistent. So I make sure I clean it and then I make sure I put on a moisturizer if I don't do nothing else, but I need to do all the extra steps. If she didn't want to spend that much money though, she can get that Sarah V. It comes in like a small bottle. It'd be like probably five dollars or less for the small bottle because you don't need that much. So now that I just don't want to be caught ashy in public. I hope don't nobody want to be ashy in public. I put on body butter today, so I'm oily. I'm trying not to lean on my keyboard and stuff because I'm slippery. I normally just do lotion, but I put on body butter today. Yeah, I got the CeraVe foaming cleanser, and then I got the CeraVe um, moisturizer, but I mostly use my own soap to clean, but if I'm in a rush, I'll just, like, squeeze some of that out and use it and put it on my face. 
but for when I do my face, I either do the African black soap or I do the oatmeal milk and honey soap for my face. And then I have toner. I got different kinds of toner. And then I got uh, the moisturizer. I got a couple of serums, but like I said, I'm going to make my own. So I'm working on a hydroluronic serum, so I'll probably just use my own. I don't know. I feel like they, it's just face stuff. They have like different brands of CRV though. So like if you have like dry skin or acne or whatever, like it's it's different stuff. Like it's different kinds if you go get it. But I do have acne. I get breakouts like every now and then. I need to get me a satin pillowcase. That probably will help because cotton holds oil and stuff. So if, if I got shit going on with my hair and then it gets on my face because of my pillow, then bam. So I need to get satin pillowcases. I keep saying it and then I keep forgetting to order some. If you keep up with it, OD, it'll be fine. It's just consistency because it takes at least three weeks for your skin to recognize a new routine and, and stuff. It's not going to happen overnight and a lot of people be impatient. And I'll be like, I'm inconsistent. That's why I know not to look for certain results because I know I won't be keeping it up. But I know at least after three weeks of using something every day, you should be good. I don't know why people put fragrances in face stuff. That makes no sense. That should be the last place to put fragrances. That's why I don't do that in my stuff. It's gonna smell like whatever the product is. Like you don't supposed to put fragrances in face stuff for, for sure. I barely put fragrance in my lotions and scrubs and stuff and like body oil, yeah, but not stuff that go on your face. That's crazy. dark spots like the turmeric stuff and and that kind of stuff will help that i think uh what's the name of the acid is it, is it hydroluronic acid or is it the other one i gotta get a book so i can write all my formulas down because it might head be a mess case changed your life. I just saw that. I feel like the best skincare that I've ever seen be Korean skincare. Like, they 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 know what they be doing, but that shit don't be cheap though. But with all this, what is that? Is it ben, Benzonite or whatever that is that normally helps with acne? And they now coming out with all these companies that they were saying got like 500 times what's supposed to be in there, a thousand times what's supposed to be in there, and it can cause cancer after all these years. Cause they brought up proactive. I was like, bitch, the way they used to push proactive back in the day when motherfuckers was in like high school and junior high, and they had all these celebrities and shit out of them. Like, if you kept using proactive 20 plus years, bitch, it don't matter now. Like, they always telling people shit after the fake. I try to stay as natural as I can with my stuff. I want all my stuff to mostly be like 100% natural. But with the fragrances, they be hard. Like, so some of my lotions gonna be probably about 90, 95% um, organic because of the synthetic fragrance. But if it's something that got an essential oil in it, then it's 100%. Because I'm like, the shit they be putting in the stores be wild and what people put in their stuff. And I just be like, that's crazy. I'm trying to get away from using, um, I'm trying to get away from using color too maybe have a colorful label but the color ain't good either if you don't get like 
organic stuff to color your stuff and then when you do sometimes the color don't hit the same and some of them vibrant colors some people don't care what they put on their body though long as it look and smell good though I'm thinking about making a uh, a batch of yoni oil that's flavored though, because I had a couple of people ask me, so I know what they want to do with it. But I'm thinking about doing that too. Ah, uh, not too threatening. Yes, because some people like flavored oil. Like if you go to the sex shop, they have flavored oil. So when you put it down there, they got something else to eat, I guess. But I've been asked that a couple of times. Like when I promote, when I promote my yoni oil, it be it be uh women in the comments that'll be like, is it flavored? I'd be like, oh, uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> but I might make a flavored match. So, child, if you make stuff for the for the poom poom boom boom. Them motherfuckers be not goddamn freaks. I mean, if you were actively with somebody and that's what y'all was doing, I mean, hey, it is what it is. There's just like people that buy edible panties. I heard those were disgusting though, but it's interesting that people be. Uh huh. Ah, please. Nah, I ain't saying nothing. Don't be quiet. I mean, to be fair, the yoni oil with a flavor is safer than if you put food down there because people don't understand that food don't need to go down there either. Like, I get people be doing shit, bitches putting whipped cream and all kind of ignorant shit down there, then you fucking wake up with a damn yeast infection and wonder why. So at least the flavored yoni oil is safer for it than people do going to use actual food product. <laughs> Slathering they shit in fucking peanut butter. <laughs> oh, let me be quiet. I ain't said a word. I'll be back. Let me go wake this bed up.
other back. Nah, I know a girl who let a dog eat her. Not without pink, huh? Oh. Um, okay. Who said something about plum powder? Did I miss something? I came back and seen the dog come in and just spaced out. <laughs> um, I'm probably gonna stop this in a minute though so that I could do so that I could do um how many of these is So that I could do real talk with Trey. Sorry, I'm like Not, I don't even know what a plum is. The fruit, you never had plums, peaches, like nectarines. Not you not know what a plum is. Plums are delicious if they did, if if they grown right. That's wild. I'm from the country though. It ain't too many fruit we have, but like. These are plums. These are plums, nephew. They have a seed in the middle, like peaches. I like plums if they've grown right. Like some people don't know how to grow them. I like the ones that are like sweet and tart, not the ones that be like overly sweet. You know what plums? Plums look like giant cherries without the stems and darker. <laughs> Think like a cherry, but like 20 times the size and then like a, a handheld cherry without the stem <laughs> and like darker. I need to move somewhere tropical where all the fruit grow on trees and I can just pick them off and live my best life because I'm about tired of America. I'm going to end my stream though y'all and I'll be back in a few minutes. Uh, to do real talk with Trey for 2.30 so hopefully I will see you guys then if not I will be streaming on Twitch later if y'all want to pull up and um, I know we doing some games for game night and then after I'm going to do the 911 episode and the Grey's Anatomy episode from last night so hopefully I will see y'all at one of those holler don't be ashy in these streets put some lotion on your meat that should be my thing so don't be ashy in these streets put some lotion on that meat <laughs> Make a whole rap.